In the 1930s, makeup legend Max Factor introduced a revolutionary invention that claimed to measure facial flaws with precision. Get ready to be amazed by the Beauty Micrometer, a clockwork orange-style device that promised to analyze a woman's beauty. This bizarre contraption, placed on and around the head and face, used flexible metal strips to align with a person's facial features. With an astonishing 325 adjustments, the operator could measure facial imperfections with a precision of one thousandth of an inch. The inventors focused on two key measurements, the heights of the nose and forehead should be the same, and the eyes should be separated by the width of one eye. If any flaws were detected, corrective makeup could be applied to enhance or subdue the feature. Max Factor, Sr., the founder of the company, claimed that this device helped him better understand the female face. It was initially designed for use in the movie industry, where flaws on the big screen could become glaring distortions. However, the beauty micrometer did not gain widespread usage and only one is believed to exist. Today, it is showcased at the Hollywood Entertainment Museum, a testament to the ingenuity of Max Factor. But who was Max Factor? Born in 1872 in what is now Poland, he started his career in the wigs and cosmetics industry at a young age. After serving in the military, he became the official cosmetics expert for the Imperial Russian Grand Opera and even the royal family. In 1904, Max Factor and his wife decided to immigrate to America due to increasing anti-Jewish persecution in the Russian Empire. They settled in Los Angeles, hoping to make their mark in the emerging motion picture industry. Max Factor's breakthrough came in 1914 when he developed the first cosmetic specifically for motion picture use. This thinner grease paint in cream form revolutionized the industry, as it wouldn't crack or cake under the intense lights. With his expertise in cosmetics, Max Factor became the go-to authority for film makeup. Movie stars flocked to his products, eager to sample the flexible grease paint, while producers sought his human hair wigs for their leading ladies. Max Factor's success didn't stop there. He marketed his range of cosmetics to the public, insisting that every girl could look like a movie star with Max Factor products. In 1920, he even changed the term cosmetics to makeup to make it more socially acceptable. In recognition of his contributions to the film industry, Max Factor received an Honorary Academy Award in 1929. Today, he is honored with a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame, forever cementing his legacy. So, next time you apply your makeup, remember the fascinating story of Max Factor and his beauty micrometer. It's a testament to the creativity and innovation that has shaped the world of beauty.